Hello, in this video we will solve a problem based on the Parcels relationship. Now the problem is calculate the energy in the signal x of n equal to sine omega n divided by pi n. So this is a discrete time signal given and we have to calculate its energy. Now we know that the formula of energy in the time domain is this integral and mod x of t whole square dt. So we can say that if we try to calculate the energy using this formula in time domain, it is very hard to calculate E of x. Now instead using this formula for calculating E of x, we will use the Parsevals relationship and we will calculate energy from its Fourier representation. So we know that x of n has a Fourier transform x of omega. This is the uh, DTFT and DTFT is periodic with period 2 pi. So the Fourier transform or DTFT of this sine omega n or sine wn by pi n will be 1 in the interval this pi is from minus omega minus w to plus w and 0 otherwise. So this is the x of omega. So this is minus w plus w and this is pi this is minus pi. So in this range it is 0 and from minus w to plus w it is 1. So this amplitude is 1. So this is the DTFT of this signal x of n. Okay. So we will use this x of omega, this spectrum of xn to calculate the energy. And we know using Parsons theorem we can use this formula for energy. Okay, so now we know x of omega which is given here. So we can calculate E of x as 1 over 2 pi in this integral omega from minus pi to pi mod x of omega whole square d omega and we'll have 1 over 2 pi from minus w to plus w it is 1 and 0 otherwise so we'll have this thing now pi will get 1 over 2 pi and integral of 1 is simply omega and the limit is from minus w to plus w and when we put this we will get w minus minus w which is 2w by 2 pi which is equal to w or w by pi so this is the energy of the given signal so energy of this signal we have calculated as W by pi. This is the answer. So we'll stop here. Thank you.